So I hope you're ready to crank on some arms because we're going to blow them up today. So just watch what we do and then give it a shot yourself. All right, that's all I'm going to say. So your first combination you're going to do today is a push down. And for those of you who've been following my work, you know that I love these single handles for push downs. And then we're going to do a drag curl. We're going to lean our back against the pole too. You'll see what I'm talking about. So that you can't cheat. You're going to literally drag the bar right up your body. So we're going to do 10 reps here and 10 reps there to get started. Set number one. All right. Cranking. Look at his lateral head. His lateral head's jacked up there. Nice. 10 reps, Mitch. There you go. All right. Now to curl. Notice we're using a wider grip today on these. Just a little bit easier to curl the bar up your body with that wider grip. Perfect. See how close the bar is into his body? That's perfect. Perfect. 10 reps. Perfect. Straight right. down. Straight down. Right there. There we go. Ladies, you're not going to get 21 inch arms doing this. Don't be scared. You're going to get too big. Just get in there, work, and tighten those arms up. Good. Right there, right up your body. Excellent. Excellent. Now, if you guys see her wrists, see how they're bent? That's, for those of you who have trouble feeling your biceps and you feel too much in your forearms, that's actually a good little trick to keep it more on your bicep. Just loosen your wrist up a little and it's more bicep. So she, she was giving you a little tip there. Okay, so this is our last set here. We've been moving real fast. So this is our fourth round. I want you to do four rounds, 10 reps on each exercise. Oh man. Okay, now we're on to our second combination. Hopefully by now your arms are feeling really good. We're gonna do a machine preacher curl, but we're loading the negative, the eccentric part. So if you watch, I'm gonna be getting extra resistance applied as I lower the weight. We're gonna do six reps like that, generating a ton of tension in the muscle. And then we're gonna move over to the dip machine. And we're gonna do eight reps, trying to keep our elbows tucked in so we can really isolate our triceps. So, here we go. 
Last one. Oh yeah. Oh, perfect. All right, notice when he's doing this, I'm not going to push the weight down until his arm's completely straight. The goal isn't to injure somebody. So with his arm, a couple inches before it locks out, I'm letting go. There you go, fight, fight. There you go, fight, tension, tension, come on. Fight me, fight me. There we go, good. Knock them out, eight reps, triceps. Elbows in, flex your tries. That's it, that's it, that's it, come on. Good job, Mitch, good job. All right. Ah. So, in terms of uh, sets on this, or rounds really, we're doing four rounds. So we do four sets on the preacher curl and four sets on the tricep machine. So four sets of each, four rounds. All right, so we're on our third and final combination now. We're doing a tricep overhead extension. Now, I don't like doing these first. I think they'll tear your elbows, tear your elbows up, but we're doing them third. Our elbows are good and warm now. Everything's greased up, it's feeling good. So now we're gonna do some, and then we're gonna do a pinwheel curl for our brachialis and brachioradialis. And we're gonna do 10 reps here and eight reps there. Now, I've already done three sets. This is my fourth set. So let's finish strong. All right, so there you have it. That was nasty. We moved fast. We did a combination with push downs and drag curls for four rounds, and then we went and did preacher curls and the dip machine. We did four rounds there, and we finished with four rounds of overhead extensions and pinwheel curls. So 12 sets of buys, 12 sets of tries. It took us about 25 minutes. We moved fast on that. Crazy pump. Give it a shot. Let me know what you think. Let me know how let me know how crazy your pump is in the comments below. Thanks for watching. I appreciate it. Have a good day.